What I've done, I have pre-mounted a certificate here in the middle of some uh, blue suede map board. And the idea that of the, that the, um, the mum of the guy that got the awards would like to do is she wants the medals to hang down on either side of this certificate. And she would like to, to not be the full length. She wants it to actually finish around here. So there were a couple of thoughts, schools of thought that I had in relation to how we could do that. And we'll go through what I was thinking. Part of, part of what we're gonna do, we'll cut a few pieces to stretchiness to it. So we could actually put that around. I think that may work best because it's clear. This is another one that's actually an invisible thread. It's quite a, a tough, so invisible I can't see where I had the end. I did tuck it in there before. Bear with me, that'd be great. It's all right, whoever last used this one. Tucked it back in um, to mount the, to hang it onto the cage. I've left that on there. And I'm just going to gently turn it over. So I want to get that in position and I actually want to tape that in position. I'm going to use some of the Filmoplast tape. You may just want to use, it's not, um, it's not like a, um, any of the good, uh, backing tapes will do the same sort of job here. The uh, acidic, acidic quite, it's quite, it's not a super aggressive uh, adhesive, but it's something that the ribbon has a certain uh, lack of stretchiness to it. And what ends up happening, and we know this from, from past experience, that it won't, if you try to move it around, you end up kinking that fabric and you can't recover it. It's better off replacing the entire ribbons. And, uh, and of course, that's not going to happen in a hurry. Now we've still got, I'm just going to slot these in. I want to check that the sizes are right because I just cut these before we came on. It's going to be pretty tight, the length. It's like everything, you, you look at these things and you, I like things when, when, we're, when we're mounting these, I really like them to be tight. So that's got a...